Hello and a very warm welcome to Card for the Day by Healing Hand Services and my name is Julie Sean. Today is Sunday the 27th of, of June 2021 and the deck I've been drawn to use today is the wonderful magical unicorn oracle cards by Doreen Virtue. So I sit here connecting to Mother Earth and Father Sky and we're calling in our angels, our archangels, our spirits, our guides, our ascended masters, our ancestors and of course the element, elementals, the beautiful unicorns. We ask the unicorns to draw near and to be by ourselves and we ask them to give us a wonderful message of wisdom, knowledge, understanding or maybe an insight we need to to know. Thank you, unicorns, for stepping close. It's connecting with our beautiful unicorns and shuffling away. Asking what message do they have for us? Oh, nearly got them all. And we have a card that is stuck to me, and it is the card finish what you've started. You've started something important and now it's time to complete it. Finish what you've started. You've started something important and now it's time to complete it. Are you a procrastinator or are you one of these people, a bit like me, who get really excited about something and you start doing the project, I don't know, writing a book, creating an oracle card set, writing an essay or reading a, a book something and you get really excited and keep going okay and then suddenly perhaps you get distracted or bored because you get that original passion that fire the excitement has disappeared and so you get distracted and you go and do something else and you get left things on the side and then you leave it and leave and then you go back and it's like I don't know I can't be bothered to do it maybe there is something that you have started and Maybe it's time to go back and redo it. Or maybe you started something and you thought you had what we call the imposter syndrome, where you think, oh, you know, maybe you thought, oh, I'll write a book and wrote a couple of passage paragraphs. And then you think, you know what? Who says I'm an author? I'm not an author. Why do I think I'm that? So you put it aside. And then you lose thinking it's self-confidence, self-confidence, lack of self-belief in yourself that maybe has stopped you from finishing off, off this project. But as we say, when you close one door, another one opens. Baby, we have some unfinished business that you need to close and get rid of before you move on. Maybe this project could be... Um, uh, an event that's happened in your past life when you were a child or a teenager in your early teens or in your 20s that happened and you're still on about it. So it could be that project and you're still maybe constantly saying, I was bullied, I was bullied, I was bullied. And you're constantly still feeling that pain. Well, maybe it's time to finish that project because it could be anything. You could name anything as a project and just say, you know what? I'm no longer let those feelings hold me down. I'm going to learn to flip it. Finish that project, that finish that event of being bullied. And what I'm doing is I'm moving forward. So if I see anyone else who's being bullied, I can actually say to them and go, look, I know what it's like to be bullied. I felt those emotions. You can commiserate with them. And then you can say to them, right, let's stand up to the bully. Or maybe you could do it on their behalf. So that's the project, you know, and it sounds silly. The project of being bullied, the project of I was a child and my parents were divorced. You know, anything Anything that you do is a project. And maybe it's time to close that door, learn the lesson and move on. Or maybe it is something like, I know, I'll write a book. Or no, I'll read this book, start reading a book, reading an article or something. Or maybe there's a series on the TV and you started watching it and it's got 12 episodes and you've got through, four, four, got through 10 and you've got another two to go. Time to finish things off. Stop it. Let it go. Close and cut off those cords, those chains. When it's gone, you've cleared a space to embrace something new and exciting. This is the message from the unicorns. Finish what you've started. You started something important and now it's time to complete it. And imagine how you feel 
when you have completed it. It's like, oh, I've done it. Look what I've done. Look what I've achieved. It's no longer holding over my head. You will feel a release. You will feel freedom. What is that project? What is that thing that you need to finish? I do hope you've enjoyed this reading and connecting with the beautiful energies of the unicorn. If you've enjoyed the reading, please remember to like, share and subscribe because someone else out there may need this message. If you'd like to have your own reading or some spiritual mentoring or learn how to meditate and connect with your guiding unicorn, please message me. Have an amazing day connecting with the amazing, magical, beautiful unicorns. Namaste. Take care. Bye.